designs can be used as a great source for brushes in Photoshop. Now, I'm just going to go to the File, Open, and I've got a selection of PDF documents here, the CAT designs from graphicextras.com. I'm just going to select one of them, Open. Now, it comes up with file size. As they're vectors, they can be any size, so it's 10,000 by 10,000. But there are actually limits on the size for a brush in various versions of Photoshop. Some versions are actually a lot smaller, so it might be like Photoshop 6, it's about 1,000 by 1,000. In uh, Photoshop CS5, it's about 2,000, 2,500 odd. So obviously that's a bit too big, so I'm going to have to reduce the size. I'm just going to create a quick brush of 1,000 by 1,000. Click OK. So I've actually defined it there. So I can just resize it quickly. And I'm just going to flatten the image, layer, flatten image. Now I could go to Edit, Define Brush Preset. And you can see the size, 866. Click OK. Now it's defined as a brush. Go to a brush tool, just select one of those. Then I can quickly display all the brushes here. Selection of brushes. Click that one. Now, you could use any PDF file that you can find on the web as well. So you don't have to use, obviously, the, the graphic extras ones. You can, of course, create your own vector designs very quickly. Use custom shapes. It's another great source for designs. So I'm just going to resize that. So now I can just paint that. So I can just change the colour. Now, another way of doing it is via the import command. So I'm just going to quickly go to that document, fill, just put it to white, click OK, and place, place command. And I'm just going to place a couple of cats, so place, click OK, and just quickly resize that. These files can be quite large, so uh, I say the it can be any size basically, so uh, to quickly resize the thing, I can of course resize it over here as well by changing the percentage of the size, the uh, the cat. So I'm just going to quickly do that. Now it's a layer, so I can quickly duplicate that layer. Duplicate. I'm just going to select another one, so I can create a slightly more complicated design. Resize that. Of course, I can rotate it, resize it in other ways, or apply different effects. Now. Flatten layer, and then I can just define the region for the brush. Edit, define brush preset, click OK. Fill the game with white. Select one of the brush tools, and there you see the brush there. So you can just apply things. So PDF documents are great sources for effective designs for brushes as well, Photoshop.